Okay, if you remember uh, from the end of the uh, part one, part two of uh, headquarters, you know, again, I, I just put this up here to. Uh, I had it in my archives. I had recorded it because I got into the game by accident. And I had it lying around on my hard drive. Thought I'd put the hell. I'll add some voice to it, and uh, maybe you guys will get a good laugh out of it. Maybe pick up something, or you know, be entertained for a few seconds and watch me get knife like that and get owned. Anyways, at the end of the part one, the guy was laying at Betty, and I don't know, he's like nowhere near the freaking headquarters. I don't know what the hell he was doing. I mean, did he think that he was going to run into the headquarters and survive and somehow get a kill with that Betty? I have no idea. But I think uh, the six on six is, uh, you know, Bettys are sort of useless, in my opinion. I mean, you'll get a kill here and there, maybe, but that's, you know, guys are tossing grenades, guys are... are had bomb squad on maybe I would have got killed there but you know with the grenade factor you're, you're not going to get a lot of kills with it and I think you're better served with grenades um, so yeah I don't know team tactical is uh, I like it a lot better with uh, headquarters and team tactical because it is more tactical and uh, you know with team tactical I would use I would probably use Betty's. I don't know. It's hard to say. Right? I mean, your your grenades are going to be a little less effective three and three. And they are six and six. I mean, the chances of you hitting somebody six and six is a lot better. Right? Okay. I didn't actually see that guy. Okay. Nice for dog here. Sweet, poor doggy. So we're gonna try and capture this one. We get. No, we get him, but we get martyred. Him. I had nowhere to go. I hate it when you're in a corner and you're, you're back against the wall and the guy drops smart and kind of sucks, but, you know, and that's actually a decent, uh, I think that's perk three. That's actually not a half bad perk um, for headquarters. Especially if you're an aggressive uh, player and you're always in at the headquarters. You know, somebody rushes in and kills you, uh, you know, you get a good shot at killing him back. So I don't think they actually had uh, they had team team tactical for World of War. I think they do now. I'm not sure, but I know they did in the first. Which kind of sucked. I used to play a lot of team tactical. We have the location of the HQ. Move in. Take the HQ. So I think um, you know I think we're doing okay. I think we if we had a couple of other uh, teammates that. That weren't so bad, that weren't laying, you know, Betty's halfway across the map from the headquarters and stuff like that. We probably would have done a lot better and it would have been a lot closer. I mean, it was a lot closer for a certain period of time. HQ but. under friendly control. And like Defend I said, I think the, uh, the round drum on the MP40 would have been better. Because, I mean, you do tend to fire a lot. It's not, again, it's not like search and destroy, you know, you take down a guy and, I mean, he's gone and. Uh, he doesn't come back, right? So, so we're leading in score. I mean, yeah, we're down a fair bit. We we'll still have the uh, scores up. Oh, because I'm not yeah. <laughs> seeing that guy left. The guy who invited me in left. Maybe we actually would have won if he would have stayed in. We have the location of the HQ. So, see what I mean? We're um, and, and I think it is more balanced in World at War because we had uh, we had captured the headquarters and then the enemy team I don't even think they recaptured it or the time ran out but it actually spawned right next to the enemy team whereas again in Modern Warfare it would have spawned right next to us as we uh, respawned So we'll try and capture this one. Hopefully, we got three guys in here. I don't know what the other three guys are doing. Really, like they're not even moving towards the headquarters. Maybe they're waiting for uh, for it to spawn somewhere else. Now we threw that in anticipation, anticipation of an enemy coming in. We actually get over here behind the barrel, unfortunately. But yeah, I don't know what uh, my teammates are doing. That last headquarters was just stupid. I don't know. Like, all three of them were in the same spot. 
then again, maybe they thought the headquarters was going to spawn there, but Recon plane acquired. I don't know, I think that's pretty bad. So I hope you like this headquarters stuff. It's a little change from uh, Search and Destroy. It's not on my forte or a cup of tea, but I think I did all right here. We actually got it this time. Our artillery will take them out. Uh, we got two minutes, just over two minutes left, so it's going to be pretty tough to come back from 200 to 150 in two minutes. So I think they're going to they're gonna capture it right now. So yeah, so they got it. Like, we basically have to capture this next one and keep it for nearly the entire time in order to win. And I don't think it's going to happen. Yeah, I got a guy through the wall. Awesome. So we actually managed to get it, but that often happens. Um, you know, you'll capture the headquarters and you'll die immediately, which kind of sucks. You don't get a chance to defend it. I love that. That was an awesome bayonet kill. We have the location of the HQ. Move in. Take the HQ. So again, not knowing the map very well. Sort of get owned there. Come on, buddy. Move in. Take the headquarters. I know I probably keep saying the same thing over and over again, but just stay on the move. Just keep moving. Headquarters under friendly control. And respawn right away. Don't wait. Right? We have the location of the headquarters. I'm gonna get shot again. I love it when they spawn spawn right behind you. It's awesome. Enemy recon play. It's a good spawn system. Yeah. <laughs> It kind of sucks getting blinded, you don't know who your uh, teammates are and who the enemies are. So we're probably going to die right away, of course, as soon as we get it. So we had two, actually two chances to come back there, and that really sucked, because they recaptured it right away. If we would have held it for, you know, any length of time, we probably could have won this match. So that really sucked. Get owned again. Yeah, I don't hold back, right? I mean, you just you just keep moving forward. You don't hold back. You're gonna die a lot. You know, headquarters is six on six headquarters isn't gonna do much for your kill death ratio. So if you're worried about that, then you probably don't want to play headquarters. So we got 42 kills, which is 12 more than anybody else. So I think that's all right. We probably got more kills than or more deaths than most, but our score was top. Visit our website at www.nextgentactics.com to find all of our video playlists, written game guides, gaming news, trailers, and more, all for free.